So I think that the way that our community has come together is there are so many people rallying around small businesses right now, trying to make sure that whether it's the business themselves is able to survive or that the staff for those companies are able to be taken care of when there's there's no work for service industry jobs. Um, we've also seen a lot of our, our bands or, or artists, they've been doing a lot of Instagram streams and, and live concerts and it's been really cool to see the outpouring of support for those creative types especially when they have no other source of income right now we've never felt anything like this before uh, there's been periods of time where our business has suffered or struggled um, for a, a number of reasons but it's not just our industry that is struggling right now it's anything with uh, with service whatsoever, whether it be bars and restaurants, uh, events, gatherings, it's the whole community is suffering, not just our company. We still see orders coming in, although the percentage is a lot smaller than it would be around this time of year. We work with a lot of customers who have a really strong online presence to begin with, so they're able to funnel sales that way. There isn't a human-to-human uh, -human or in-person um, interaction for their sales. We also do a lot of fulfillment, and that generates sales as Customers are now ordering things online because they're stuck at home, so that's replenishing us uh, on our production side, but it has slowed considerably. The biggest challenge we're facing is the lack of work and trying to keep our staff employed. Our, our goal is to make sure that they have a job to come back to, and it's a very fine line of making sure that we have people employed versus making sure that the company is not at risk. And it's been a very difficult time trying to figure out where exactly that line is. I think the only way the decorated apparel community will get through this right now is by working with their local community and also relying on other printers or promotional products of other decorators uh, to help work together. The advice I would give to other printers right now is to take this time where maybe things are slow and try and refine some of your processes. I highly suggest looking into your profit first accounting for any screen printers out there who haven't done it. We've been doing the program for about a year now and I think that it's made it so during this uncertain time uh, we have a cushion that we can rely on where we're not stressed out about money per se but we're stressed out about uh, you know employees so it's a little bit different but profit first I think is a really good thing to be looking at especially right now.